All that externalities refers to are the costs of capitalist activities that capitalists don't have to count. The way it's handled in economics is there's a distinction between private costs and social costs, and that it's important to understand that the costs that capitalists care about are the costs they have to pay, the costs they have to cover. They don't care about the other costs because there's no outlay of cash by them. So when they look at the cost of anything, they're only looking at the costs they have to cover. And if they can make money more by doing something than the costs they have to cover, they do it. But the point of the distinction is to understand that that's not efficient. Now, there is a way that most people kind of get that these days, even if they're not familiar with the concept. It has to do with environmentalism. You know, we're all aware that for decades, all kinds of capitalists, manufacturers, service providers, have been choosing to do things that they claim were profitable and that they claim were efficient, as have the economists who defend this. But they're wrong. We now know that, for example, the trucking firm that took care of waste products that were polluted in all different ways, that trucking firm only took into account the private costs it faced. It had to buy the trucks, it had to hire the truck drivers, it had to pay for the gas that works the truck, and so on. But what that truck spewed into the air and the damage done by the exhaust from that truck to the health of people, to the number of doctor visits they had to undergo, to the speed with which gardens had to be replanted because the polluted air particles fell on the plants or corroded the rubber in their tires or diminished the number of years that the paint would last on their homes. The stories are infinite. None of those costs are borne by the capitalist. We, the people, pick up the costs. We have to clean our houses more often. We have to buy vacuum cleaners more often to clean the results of that pollution. We pay for the vacuum cleaners. We pay. You get the picture. The costs are real, but they're not paid for by the capitalists. So when the capitalist counts, is this project worth, do it, worth doing? Are the benefits greater than the costs? Because the capitalist only counts the private costs he or she has to cover, the calculations made by capitalists are not the right ones. They don't get you the efficient outcome. Capitalism isn't efficient, and it never was, because it fails to count the social costs. It only counts the private costs, and those are never all of the costs.